hello friends this is Venu in this video I am explaining about how to upload CSV data into Oracle it's simple in my previous video I have already explained how to create a, a Oracle instance in AWS and uh, and okay now in this video I am explaining about how to download a sample CSV and how to process it okay um, basically you can download any CSV data like uh, wait a bit I will show you For example, something I don't know. I'm googling it. Yes, this is also not best. Mm, actually, okay, very good. First name, last name, and uh, okay, fine. This is 500 records. If you want to process, download it. If you process millions, you can download it. 10 rupees. To shoot temporarily, I'm using this one. So. Okay, extract here. Okay, you yes. Okay, what is this? It's not attracting. Mm. Copy. And I hope CSV data I am pasting here. What is this? It's taking something time. One second. <laughs> it's down ahead. It's already down out. Down ahead. Okay click on this link this is first name last name and company whatever it may be okay still if you want to know click this link okay you can get it this is first name last name company address city and email something well okay i want to upload this data into then what should I do with this okay first of all go to SQL developer I hope you know simply click on this link and uh, I hope your client already you have in these credentials and in my previous video I have already explained this is the table this is Oracle table uh, sorry connection name your wish to identify this is username this is password and this is uh, instance ID instance name and this is database and this is port ok finally test it and uh, it's success so connect it if I connect it automatically I will get this Oracle ok this is for CL. There is no any table. Now uh, we are importing this table into this product. Then what should you do? Simply click this, click on this link, and you will get tables, views, and etc. Click on this link. There is no any table. That's why you are displaying like this. Right click and import data and uh, select this data where you have copied i think downloads csv and us csv okay this is you can check home download csv us csv okay this is first name last name whatever it may be 
almost depends on your data sets you can change this parameter this is preview okay next and the table name your wish for example i am creating sample table this table name is sample table okay and uh, i don't want i don't i am not interested to mention only 100 rows etc it's 500 record rows so if only 100 click this link okay if you don't want other fields you can skip here whatever for example if you if you don't want anything click this you want our, our everything keep here okay next and uh, if you want to change the data types or names you can change here for example first underscore name i don't want first name change here not a problem okay finally next done it's almost finished if you wait a couple of minutes so you can ignore simply in case any error done okay it's imported successfully if you want to know click on this, uh, refresh this is refresh then you will get this sample table this is table name click on this link sample table is a name this is this is schema if you want to know click on this link you will get internal in the data james just now you can check this csv data James or something art James something art like that whatever it may be you can get all data okay uh, I think you understand this table and uh, my, in my next video I will explain how to get this Oracle data into spark Apache spark okay I want to process this data then what should I do in my previous video sorry in my next video I will explain how to process this Oracle data in Spark? I now this data in Oracle. I want to get this data into Spark and I need to process. I will explain in my next video. Thank you, thank you very much. If you have any doubts, comment below. Thanks a lot. Bye bye.